Did you know System 1 have made a tiny little change that actually can be really game changing if you're a GP, nurse, pharmacist or physiotherapist working in both primary care or potentially elsewhere as well. And I'm going to tell you what exactly that is right now. So med threes are a common part of the journey in general practice. And in this episode, I'm going to show you something that System 1 have changed that is really quite awesome and time saving. And it may even seem insignificant to some, but to me, oh my gosh, it is great. Working in a population like I do, I have to issue many med three fit notes and also coordinate the issuing of many of those through my R's roles and other members of the team. I often deal with many patients who need continuations or repeat med three fit notes. And the workflow for us in primary care has always been that you have to issue a new one, write it up, etc., etc. Well, System 1 have made a really small change, but one that makes that workflow so much quicker. And that is by simply adding a reissue med three option. Now, to be clear, this is not the reprint function that has been there for many years, but this is a reissue function, which basically means when you click on it, it will copy over a previous med three, or one that you've selected, and copy over all the information in that previously issued med three. The only thing you need to do is adjust the dates to make sure it's appropriate. It will obviously do it from the date that you're doing it, but if you do need to backdate it, you need to check on that, and then obviously add in the length of time that that is appropriate. You can then obviously make any further adjustments if that's necessary. But the key benefit is you don't have to figure out, do I have to add in the right code for the diagnosis? Do I have to add in all that information about the maybe fit aspect when it comes to amended roles, amended duties, times, etc., and things? And although it may only save a few seconds, it's a few seconds that, let's be honest, is very valuable to both you and your patients. Did you know that they did this? Because I don't think many people do. So definitely share this video with your teammates in practices and elsewhere, because you may save them valuable time. Speaking of time, if you do want to check out more information on how to use System 1 more effectively, check out this playlist. Alternately, you can join my Using System 1 for Clinicians course. Links are right here. And as ever, we're here to help save you time by tech enhancing your primary care and learning.